Hello, I am Plumpy from WhatCulture.com. I'm joined by Ben from WhatCulture.com. Hello. Hello. Uh, we're some rather somber news, unfortunately, uh, today with uh, with regard to the, the Justice League movie and Zack Snyder's uh, relation to it. Actually, yes. Zack and his wife Deborah, because she's also a producer on the film. Right. Um, for those of you who, who don't yet know, it was announced uh, yesterday that Zack Snyder is stepping down as director from Justice League. Uh, of course, majority of it's been filmed. Mm -hmm. It's in post production. However, there there's new footage right. that is to be shot. There was a screening um, for just a very intimate circle and then on the back of that screening it was decided that additional scenes needed to be shot. Joss Whedon was originally brought in to write those scenes uh, and now uh, Joss Whedon is taking over uh, directing those scenes and supervising production um, for now until until it seems fit that Zack Snyder may return right. to the project. The reason um, for this is uh, something that was not made public and has only been made public because Zack Snyder's had to leave production, which is unfortunately uh, back in March, uh, his and Deborah Snyder's daughter, uh, Autumn, um, committed suicide. Mm -hmm. Which is absolutely awful, uh, obviously, and our thoughts go to Zack Snyder and his family. Yes, absolutely, of course. Um, he's uh, released a statement to The Hollywood Reporter saying, uh, in my mind I thought it was a cathartic thing to go back to work, just to bury myself and see if that was the way through it. The demands of this job are pretty intense. It's all consuming. The last two months I've come to the realisation uh, I've decided to take a step back from the movie to be with my family, be with my kids who really need me. They're all having a hard time. I'm having a hard time. Mm -hmm. um, which absolutely makes uh, complete sense. Yeah. Um, it's, I, it's difficult to discuss really, obviously. It we, is. With, that's, that's awful. Um, and if we can put that aside and just talk about the film, obviously. Uh, Joss Whedon is a, is a very stable hand and lots of people have been talking for a while about how Joss Whedon might come in to do DC stuff mm -hmm. uh, but it sounds like he is purely in a in a shepherding position here yeah, just, to, just to get it through the, the last I think stretch. it would be a mistake for anyone to expect um, the movie to suddenly take on a different tone A touch of Whedon Yeah, I mean, like the, the, these scenes that were originally going to be written by him will probably have hit some traditional snark of his and right. you know maybe like because they are I'm, I'm sure they're supposed to be character scenes and who does char large ensemble character scenes better than mm. Joss Whedon yep. um, but of course the tone has been set by Snyder that's not going to be deviated from as Warner Brothers president Toby Emmerich says uh, Warner Brothers pictures president rather uh, the directing is minimal uh, and it has to adhere to the style and tone and the template that Zack set. We're not introducing any new characters. It's the same characters in some new scenes. He's handing the bat on to Joss, but the course has really been set by Zack. I still believe that despite this tragedy, we'll still end up with a great movie. Um, obviously, we hope so. Uh, yes. I know like we've often, you know, we've dealt with the criticism that we're, we're very critical of, of DC's output. Um, mm -hmm. I, I believe that we come from the standpoint of we react to the movies as they are put in front of us. We yeah. watch the movies and we give our opinions mm -hmm. on the movies and I don't think we've ever gone in hoping that a movie's going to be bad. Right, exactly. I, I, like, I like superheroes. I like superhero films. I grew up watching Batman the Animated Series yep. and loving all of that stuff. In, in, in comics term, I'm a DC boy at heart. Mm. I, that, that's where my loyalties lie there. Um, so obviously we hope the Justice League um, movie comes together. Yes. So yeah, uh, obviously our, our thoughts are with the Snyder family. Mm -hmm. um, and yes, res respect, big yeah, respect. Massive to respect Snyder. to Zack Snyder for actually coming back to work and trying to trying to finish the film under under the circumstances. Obviously, that takes a, an immense amount more uh, testicular fortitude than I would have because it, it must be absolutely awful. You can't imagine. Mm -hmm. You just you just can't. Um, th there was original uh, thought that the movie would be pushed back, mm -hmm. um, but instead, with with Joss Whedon stepping in, uh, it is slated to still hit the November seventh uh, release date. Good. And uh, as, as Emmerich says, I, I hope it will be a great film. Yes, and we'll be bringing you more news on Justice League as we have it. I've been Ben from World Culture. I have been Plumpy from World Culture, and we'll see you soon.